Righto, Taliota champs, this is the new 27 inch iMac. Yes, the base model this is, so this has the AMD 5300 Radeon Pro graphics, and it also has the i5, the six core i5, and yes, you can see the telemetry on the top left hand corner, and you, can, you can't hear it, you can hear the speakers, by the way, because this is so silent when it games, the speakers are awesome on this. Just turn that sound down, sorry about that. Now, the display looks awesome too. And you can see there, 120 frames per second. We're getting 70 uh, degrees on the CPU and 72 on the CPU. Now the good thing is, the speakers are awesome on this and you can actually hear them because this is not a hairdryer. This is virtually silent. I will actually put the microphone up to it in a sec so you can hear that there's virtually no fan noise. And holy cow. And if there was a bit of fan noise, uh, you'd have to be in a quiet room to hear it so it's actually really good in that regard and even on battlefield you know the fan speed was very low the noise was low and virtually you know it's almost silent virtually and that's under gaming loads and gaming loads are very intensive and basically if you're using this for video editing and stuff like that you're probably never going to hear the fans at all and you can see here it's pushing 120 frames per second 1080p high now it is a 5k display 16 by 9 27 inch 5k display you don't want to be playing at 5k okay and the good thing about this is it's an intel system so just boot into windows you can play all the games you want all right so the one downside about the apple silicon ones is you won't be able to do this sort of stuff you won't be able to game this is like a windows desktop now and it's awesome that you can play all the games you want all the windows games AAA titles i can't wait actually until this cop is annoying me i can't actually wait until flight simulator comes out how awesome will that be on this and you can see look the temperatures 60 watts on the gpu 78 degrees Oh, this car is really shaking. I better get another car. And what? 82 degrees. Oh, hope I don't get run over. Oh, I need another car. Um, 80 degrees on the CPU. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's pretty hectic here. Whoa, whoa. I'm going to get hit. Oh, <laughs> it was inevitable, wasn't it? Come on, run. No worries. Oh. But anyway, we'll show you some other gameplay. I'll show you some benchmarks. It's a great gaming machine. It's silent. And here, listen. No fan noise. No fan noise whatsoever under a gaming load. And even in Battlefield, the fans were very low. Uh, no noise at all. Beautiful display. The games look awesome on it. And by the way, um, the display... Yeah, it's not fast, it's not a gaming display. And yeah, if you're used to a high refresh rate gaming sort of display, yeah, you may get drunk watching this because yeah, it's a slow display and you can see it is ghosty sort of display. I mean, it's a high quality display, 500 nits, it's awesome, but for gaming, it is slow. Now, you know, a lot of people pay good money to get drunk and get high on drugs. You get that for free with this iMac, okay? That comes standard if you want a game on it. Nah, in all seriousness, what do you expect? 60 hertz display, yeah, it's not made for gaming. It's great for gaming because it's silent. The speakers on it are really nice as well. I'll just turn up the speakers so you can. And I think you agree because you can't hear the fans. Awesome, isn't it? Please don't swear. Please don't swear. Don't get me banned. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Hope this music is not copyrighted. The sound is awesome too. Okay, so the sound's good. It's a great gaming machine, and this is n something you're not gonna get with Apple Silicon. So I like this thing for gaming. Check out the benchmarks, check out the GTA run, the benchmark for that. Um, that's the best thing about these Intel systems. And this is the base model and you're playing pretty much every single game, 1080p, high settings. 
and look, you're getting 130 frames on GTA 5. So, you know, the base model can do that. The only thing that this has upgraded is the RAM. The RAM, it has 16 gigs because I've put 16 gigs in it and it's running at 3,200 megahertz, the RAM. So, yeah, check out my last video if you want to know how to upgrade, but you can put 3,200 megahertz RAM in this. So, that's the best thing, right? It's great for gaming. Um, you whack it into Windows and, of course, you can play you know, Mac in Mac OS, if you no know, Fortnite or Civilization or whatever, you don't have to go into Windows, but if you want those Windows games, you can. That's why the Intel system will be better than you know the Apple Silicon. Alright, it's got the bezels. Whatever. It's great. You're gonna love it. Catch in the next one, Sally Ho. Uh -huh.